brush strokes of grass. Blades sit tall in the indigo sky. Delicate sweet drips of dewy tears are a contrasting expression from my third eye perception. So you don't see what I see. A masterpiece, a spherical canvas, three colors in 3D and no CGI to disconnect us using AI. Earth. Any absolute judgment or obstruction of the curator's curation magnifies your misinterpretation. So I'm reimagining a better story today so you can subconsciously get the better picture for tomorrow. Entertain the possibility, the probable chance that you were birthed from birth to obtain complete knowledge but misguided. Handicapped by those nearsighted who convinced you to believe in the narrative they fed you. In the name of whatever you call your holy deity, I drop a gem. Whole or fragmented, it behooves you to pick up the pieces and invest in your own transcendence. Picture me rolling, then pump the passion of a compassionate Tupac sound in your ear and picture that energy still rolling. Let no original piece of artwork be judged inaccurately by an interpreter. The flow is concurrent. The current supports the fish in water, limited in his perception or unlimited in the belief of a perception. Now here's the anomaly. Despite the view of its complexity, the universe moves in harmony. No political strategy or greed operating outside this approach can scientifically alter that. Why stain an artist's masterpiece with judgment? Why do we consistently project blasphemy to the rarity of a Picasso? In addition to this addition wall mounted on truth, if we are made in the image of our creator, why the confusion? Why the rejection? Why self-reflect and project so much distortion? I mean, should we have now learned by the intelligence of the indigenous? Simply put, Earth.